Hey there everybody, it's Mike Delicio with another Dice Tower Daily Unboxing. Today we're going to be taking a look at Polder's Flip and Write. Coming from Jolly Dutch, it looks like it won a first prize thematic game for Roll and Write contest on BGG, at least according to my rudimentary skills at trying to uh, read German. Here it says, your investment in the grandiose ideas of Master Legwater has paid off. Use your wits to fill the polders he has created with the right content. Combine buildings and lands to increase your score, and don't forget to block your opponents. All right, well, a flip and right game. Two to four players, 30 to 45 minutes. Let's take a look inside the box. We've got rules in different languages. Looks like this is going to be the English rule book. All right. So we see our game set up here. How to play. Five rounds, each round consisting of five turns. Every turn, a player takes the top three polder-shaped cards from the deck and turns them over. I believe that means uh, there are some translation issues, I would say, here. And they show what a turn looks like. You've got some drawing rules, assignments, and scoring. The game ending after the fifth round shows you how you earn points. They've got a scoring example here in the first appendix. And then you've got the assignment cards in the second appendix. All right. So these appear to be dry erase. All right. So let's look at these. All right. There we go. And we've got another dry erase board here with dry erase markers, as you might expect. Some cubes, ah, yes, cubes. And then a little small deck of cards. So let's take a look at those cards. As in many of these flip and write or roll and write or whatever verb and write you want, there's uh, not a whole lot of components. You can save on that, especially when you're doing roll and, or see when you're doing dry erase because you don't have to have a bunch of paper here. So here's the different polder shapes that I'm assuming you'll be putting on your own player boards. And here are your assignments. Farm frenzy, set builder, horizontal rows, vertical columns, area control, so different ways of scoring points. And then some promotional cards there. All right, well, that is Polder's Flip and Write. Thank you for watching another Dice Tower Daily Unboxing.